Cancer, hello. Welcome to your love reading for the month of November of 2023. This energy is going to be for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, as well as the Cancer Lover. If you are here in the house tonight, my name is Antoine and I'm going to welcome you for, uh, thank you for your time, excuse me. Energies for Cancer for November in love. What's going on for Cancer? Okay, tie the knot, Cancer. All right. And then under the deck here, we have nostalgia. Wow. Ooh. Oh, listen, Cancer. Um, <laughs> I don't mean to alarm you, but uh, someone is in pursuit of you. Someone from your past, for sure. Um, someone who... Uh, I feel that they, I feel like they want to earn another chance with you. Um, and if they get to, like, they want to, like, make it official. Like, they want to lock it in. Okay? It doesn't necessarily mean that things ended badly before. Um, I don't, and in fact, I don't even feel like that at all. But it definitely feels like someone wants another shot with you. They want another chance with you. Um, maybe even they want to prove to you how serious they really can be. And that could have been a part of what maybe not allowed things to really progress before in the past was that, Cancer, you were a little unsure of how serious this person really wanted to be with you. And I think that now they actually want to, they, they really want to secure this. They really want to lock it in. Let's go ahead and pull some tarot. All right. Yeah, so we have the Empress here. Two of Pentacles. Oh, goodness. The Three of Pentacles. Listen, somebody is has considerate, like someone has really, really like weighed up the uh, pros and cons of you in their life versus you not in their life. And they feel like there's more value added to their life with you in it. And so they want to build, they want to grow, they want to collaborate. king of cups yeah they want to love you they want to put their love for you they want to like they they they, they want to they want to they want to show you that they love you excuse the sirens in the background um six of cups there's that nostalgic energy again um there's, they, they want to, I feel like they want to show you uh, how, how much they've matured since the last time that y'all have had dealings with one another as well. That's a huge part of this energy. So like they just, it's just someone, now this is not to say that you are going to choose to be with them, right? Because you always have a choice, but I feel like. For the most part, <laughs> some of you may actually consider, which is all the other person wants anyway. They just want you to consider cancer because they have. And, and, and they've decided that, like I said before, they, they see more value in their life with you in it. All right, so let's continue. Ooh, <laughs> two of cups, right on top of the two of pentacles. The six of swords, okay? So we have another six popping up in the reading. Oh, the world. 
Oh, the Queen of Swords. Okay. The Nine of Pentacles. Okay, Cancer. Let me tell you what I feel. <laughs> the energy that you reciprocate back towards this person kind of feels like, all right, so that's what you're saying. All right, well, well, show me. Okay. Um, and it feels like, you know, if I, if it's like with the six of swords energy, it's like, all right, plead your case to me. Why should I come back into a situation with you now after I've already, you know, moved away from that before for whatever reason? And again, not to, not to say that there was some nasty breakup before because it doesn't feel that way, but still, why should you go backwards, right? Is the question that you're asking yourself. You're fine on your own, Nine of Pentacles. Okay? Queen of Swords energy is just wanting to be upfront and honest about everything. Okay? I feel like you already... Like you, I feel like though you do want to step into a whole new world. You 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 do recognize and see this person as someone who's different than before. But it doesn't mean that you still don't want to kind of uh, <laughs> not put them through the ringer, right? But at the same time, like you still want them to know that before I step back into something with you, like I have to, like I have to know for a periodic. For a period of time, like if you're if you're serious or not, like I'm not just going to say, oh, he's changed or she's changed. Uh, let me jump back in. It doesn't work that way. Sure, I'll give you a chance, but you're going to have to prove this to me over time. It's kind of how it feels. And it feels like they're they're willing to do that as well, because like I said, they've seen the value of you without uh, they they've felt your absence. And now they just see more value in their life now with you there versus without it. And not to say that, you know, they just want what you have or what, you know, they, they, they want what you value or anything like that. You know, they come with their own value as well. But, but that's the point with the Three of Pentacles here is that they want to, they want to merge that. They want to work together with you. So, Cancer, this is this is a cute reading. <laughs> Let me know how this is working out in the comment box below. Thank you for your time. I appreciate you. Again, see you later.